guys, it's Angie. Today's video is going to be dedicated to brushes, specifically makeup brushes and some of my favorite ones. I have split them into categories. I'm going to do my eye brushes and then I'm going to do my favorite face brushes. And I think this is a really beneficial video because lots of you have asked me, you know, what's the best brushes? What kind of brushes do you use? So here we go. I also want to mention a site that I have my brushes all listed on so you can easily see them. And it's called loveocracy.com. Loveocracy. What a cool name, right? Anyway, it's kind of like Pinterest, but for online shoppers. It's a pretty fantastic little site. As I said, the site is like Pinterest, but for the online shoppers and all of us, I know I'm a big online shopper. It's a thing. It's a habit. Anyway, um, so you pin your favorite products and you can find them throughout the internet and you put them in a collection and say your friend looks at your collection and buys from your collection, you would get a commission off of that sale. So it's like you're getting rewarded for having good taste and for sharing your favorite products, which is a win-win for everybody involved in my opinion. And Loveocracy has agents that facilitate the sales. So what they will do is go out and search for the best price on the internet for the product that you are buying. And that is super duper mega awesome because I've been overcharged many times on things. So you won't be overcharged and you'll get the best price. The agents also facilitate shipping as well as returns on the products. Everyone that signs up does get a $10 credit as soon as they sign up and you can use that towards anything on the site. So for instance, if you did like one of these brushes, you could use the credit to get $10 off. I'll also be doing a giveaway for two $50 credits to my Loveocracy collection. So two of you guys who sign up at the link below will get a chance to win $50 worth of the brushes that I'm showing or whatever's going to be in my collection. So that's a really cool thing. Let's get to the eye brushes, shall we? The first one is the Deluxe Crease Brush from Crown, and this is a Italian Badger series, I believe. This is an incredibly soft brush. I love it. I use it all the time for diffusing out, especially right here in the crease area. Um, it blends perfectly, and it just diffuses out eyeshadow like a dream. It feels like a butterfly has landed on your eyelid. Next we have Max 217. This is my absolute favorite eye brush of all time. You can use it for so many things. You can use it to apply highlight. You can use it to apply color on the lid. You can use it to blend out the crease. It's perfect. It's a beautiful brush. I have like seven of these and I love them to pieces. Um, definitely, if you're gonna get an eye brush, this is the number one that I, that I would pick because it can do everything. It's a multitasker. Next we have a brush from V. Neal and this is also a crown brush and it's called the Crease Brush. It's V's favorite brush. And it's kind of like a pencil brush, so it adds definition to the outer V of the eye. And it also can smudge some eyeliner up underneath here, or some eyeshadow, whatever you choose to do. And it's really nice and soft, and I love it. Next brush is along the same vein, and it is from Royal and Lang Nichols Silk Green Line. It looks like this. It is the GL4 Smudger. Again, same concept, smudges and defines. Awesome, awesome brush. And I love the handle because it kind of tapers off to a thin, tiny point. I like that. This brush is pretty essential to everyone and anyone who wants to pack on eyeshadow to their lid. And this is the shader brush, the 305 from Sedona Lace. Looks like this, filbert style, paddle style brush. And it just kind of pats on the color to the eyelid. And it's really, really awesome for that. Next brush is an angled liner brush from Sedona Lace as well, and it looks like this. This is what I do my eyebrows with, and it's great for picking up eyeshadow and just kind of blending it in and creating like, you know, some eyebrows if you need them, like I do. That's a great little brush. And that wraps up my eye brushes. So moving right along, we have some concealer brushes for the face. This is a Sedona Lace 224. It looks like this. This is meant to be kind of like a finger shape, so it can get into all of your little crevices. It can get into where your nose meets the old face. It can get, you know, up here on your forehead if you have a small forehead like me and you can't really put a big, huge foundation brush up there because it would be all up in your hair. But this is a great brush. Um, love it to pieces. And then we have this one from Sonia Kashuk, which you can find at Target. And it's fantastic for the same kind of purpose. I use it a lot of times when I'm trying to mesh my foundation with my concealer because sometimes they meet and they're just like no so i just kind of you know pat it together you can roll it you can get in your nose and you can do all kinds of things with this brush so it's awesome now we have my favorite foundation brushes and i have a really good cheapy this is the powder brush from elf it's their studio line and it's three dollars i've had this probably for two years two three years now and it's i mean they come apart there's no denying like they, they 
they come apart uh, but they work so flawlessly for applying foundation and what you do is you apply you know a little bit of water or fix plus right on there and just buff it into the skin and it's beautiful and this one is built a little bit better it's from Sedona Lace again same concept I love the flat buffing qualities of these types of brushes so if you want a like one that's gonna last you you know a long time try this one I only have one powder brush and it's also from Royal Lang Nickel. It's the Silk Green Line Powder in Drill 1. This baby feels like, oh, I don't know. It's synthetic, which is good. And it also has that taper point thing that I love. But it just, it feels great. It applies powder really well. I really don't have anything else to say other than I love it. So now we have the Tulip Contour Brush. And this is my favorite contour shape brush. Um, I have angled brushes, I've used them for years, but once I found this one I kind of just was like, I must contour my face with this. And it just fits really nicely, as you can see the brushes taper, so you get the amount of product here, you get the most amount of product here, and then these brushes on the side blend it out, so it's really, <laughs> it's a foolproof type of contour brush, so I highly, highly recommend this one. Speaking of angled contour brushes, this one is also from V, which is crown brush if you didn't know. This is the angled brush, and I like this one more than the MAC angled brush because it's not splayed out. Like the MAC one is just kind of like, it's like, wow, Bob Ross's hair. But this one is more compact, it's more densely packed, and you can really do a great contour with it as well. So, good job on that one, V. Then finally, I have the MAC 109. I've tried similar brushes in the same kind of range, and none of them compared to the MAC one. Uh, it's just perfect. It's really domed really nicely, so you can do contour with it. You can even do blush application with it. I love to highlight with it. I love to highlight all the different, you know, places on my face with it. I think it's just, you know, densely packed and soft and nice, and just, it applies like a dream as well. I did want to mention two brush sets from Sedona Lace as well. We have their Vortex brush set, which is probably my favorite of all the brush sets I've ever tried because a ton of my favorite brushes are in there. And it's a really good deal because you can try a lot of brushes at once. Um, it just depends on what kind of brushes you're looking for. So there's a lot of face and there's a lot of eye brushes in this one. So it's kind of like a, a, a wonderful collection of brushes. The last brush set I want to mention is the 12 piece professional brush set also from Sedona Lace and everybody always asks me is this similar to another company same pretty much the same brush pretty much the same quality honestly and it's cheaper so I always recommend the Sedona Lace over the other companies because I think that you know it's the same quality it's the same brush the other companies just jacking the prices up so I'm gonna stick with Sedona Lace on that one Alright guys, that wraps up my brushes video. Hope you enjoyed my favorite brushes. These are my favorite go-to that I use every day and love and have loved for years. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, thumbs it up. Also, join me on Lavocracy and you can see my collection in person, in the flesh, and all that stuff. And if, you know, you want to join, join. You'll have a chance to win $50 worth of my collection or you'll get $10 as a credit. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. Take care. Bye.